Okay, so I've uh, got the two gable ends framed up. I'm just going to show you what this is going to look like. Um, I videoed the first one, the second one I just made, um, and then we'll be ready to sheet it and uh, do some other cuts for some boards for some of the rafters. And uh, I think we should be ready to uh, go and start putting the roof on uh, at, out at the uh, land here. Okay, here is the framed out gable end. We'll just sheet this and uh, basically uh, the ridge pole here will pull it out um, after but that'll slide through the front and back uh, of the walls and then the other raft, one of the other rafters will go in the center and the other one will go on the overhang. So uh, basically I just framed up a center support that the uh, ridge beam will go on to. Uh, there's lots of different ways to do this but uh, I'm just kind of experimenting because I'm going to have to do something for the cabin roof too and I'm just trying to see how a few things work. And uh, you can see here I had a had a sleeper board in just as a guide or a template and when we go to the land uh, from bird mouth to bird mouth will sit exactly on top of the walls over the sheeting. So hopefully we prefabbed everything, measured everything like a billion times here. And uh, when we go out, we'll be able to put the roof on to the outhouse and uh, just screw it down. Uh, the next thing I'm going to do actually, I'm just going to pre-drill some pilot holes at least partway through um, the rafters. Just so when we go out there, I can put in the uh, uh, timber screws and just screw this onto uh, our structure and just make it go that much quicker but anyways that's it for uh, framing these rafters out uh, next thing we're going to do is sheet it and uh, we'll go ahead and do that next